Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. I've just been studying the new mushroom mechanics in the 1.13 snapshots. I'll give you the lowdown so you can grow a sweet house like this one. In 1.12, blocks inside the cap or in the corner of a red mushroom don't stop it from growing, and the blocks inside remain intact. This is useful for mushroom farms that put pistons on the inside of the mushroom or in the corners. Either of these locations will block it from growing in 1.13. Recent versions have introduced super tall mushrooms, but there was no way to force them to grow. This is now possible in the new 1.13 snapshots. Currently, both red and brown mushrooms need a 6 high space to grow a 5 high mushroom. The gap is no longer necessary for red mushrooms in the new snapshots. In 1.12 and prior, red mushrooms actually reuse the brown mushroom code for checking that a location is valid. Blocks around the top like this prevent it from growing. But a similar setup in the 1.13 snapshots allows the mushrooms to grow. Red mushrooms now have their own code. For automated farms, you need bone meal dispensers at the base of the stem, so it's important that this functionality is maintained. Fortunately, this still works. You just can't have blocks inside the cap. As far as I can tell, none of the growth restrictions for brown mushrooms have changed, so you still need an extra space above the mushroom. Everything I checked seems to work exactly the same in the snapshots. One frequently used mechanic is that leaves can be used to selectively prevent some of the mushroom blocks from generating. This has been changed. They still don't block the mushroom from growing, but the leaves are replaced. This change also applies to brown mushrooms. Now let me show you the most useless Minecraft mechanic you've never heard of. Tragically, it's gone in 1.13. This related bug, however, is a bit more useful. An important use of red mushrooms is to delete end portal frames. This is necessary if you want to build a sand duplicator. You're going to have to find another trick for 1.13. This is everything I've discovered about 1.13 mushroom mechanics so far. Let me know in the comments if I've missed anything.